He thought he knew what he had until he heard the story behind it. In the crazy world of reselling, Walter Blake Knobloch stands out among the crows. On his YouTube channel, Walter delves into the intricacies of reselling with a blend of humor, spicy opinions, and valuable insights. However, one of his recent videos diverges from the norm, capturing an incredibly wholesome outcome that underscores the human element in the world of commerce. In this touching account, Walter shares an experience that transcends the typical buy and sell dynamic. After selling an old Finnish Bible from 1899, he received a message from the buyer that profoundly impacted him. Immediately after I sold it, I got a message from the buyer, Walter recalls. But this wasn't a complaint or a cancellation, but something far more significant. The Bible, a relic Walter had salvaged from a condemned house nearly two years prior, was more than just an antique. It was a vessel of personal history, filled with the echoes of a family's past. Walter had listed this piece of history for about $170, a price reflective of its value and his efforts in preserving it. Considering the rent I pay in this warehouse, considering what I had to go through to pull it out of layers and layers of filth and grime, Walter explains, justifying the price he set for this unique item. The buyer's message revealed a miraculous twist. The Bible belonged to their family. The last name you see here is the sister-in-law of the woman who bought it. It's her grandmother. Walter shares, unveiling the personal connection that transformed this sale into a reunion of a cherished family heirloom. This revelation not only added emotional depth to the transaction, but also highlighted the serendipitous nature of Walter's work in reselling. Walter's response to this discovery was one of genuine joy and fulfillment. This is why I love doing this, he reflects emphasizing the satisfaction he derives from reuniting people with pieces of their personal history. His role transcended reselling as he became a custodian of memories, a connector of past and present. In his video, Walter also contemplates the value of such items beyond their monetary worth. Addressing a hypothetical scenario, he states, if they had asked me if I could sell it for less, would I have still sold it to them? Yes, I would have. This sentiment underscores Walter's respect for the emotional significance of the items he sells and his willingness to prioritize human connections over profit. Sometimes material things hold more value in their story than their makeup. Walter's experience just goes to show that behind every item, there's a story waiting to be told, a memory waiting to be cherished. As Walter aptly puts it, Knowing that you went out of your way to save a relic that matters a lot to someone is a good feeling.